Here we go, blah, 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 Vegas, baby. Woo, woo, raise the roof. All of that. Put all that in one. Mix it up in one big stewy, gooey pot. And then let's celebrate. Let's celebrate Las Vegas. Here we come, Henderson Funk Night. With Gary Sider of Parliament Funkadelic. And Norwood Fisher. And cocaine. K O K A N E. Not the drug. Here we go. Getting on the freeway. Getting towards the freeway from an undisclosed location. Because I ain't got nothing to say. Who doesn't love a road trip? Who doesn't love a road trip? Raise your hand. Put your goddamn hand down. Vegas. Viva Las Vegas. I mean, it's kind of cool. It is still cool. I mean, I'm a front, and I'm going to be, you know, all like this and all like that, but... I mean, I know it's cool to go to Vegas. I know it's still cool to go to Vegas. I've been going to Vegas for what? 40 years now. And it's still cool. It's like it's still cool to ride down Sunset Boulevard. It still feel cool after all these years. Because the prestige and the ideal is still, you know, it's Vegas. Bob Vegas, man. Okay, so it really may be Henderson, but actually I'm staying in Vegas. Henderson is a district of Las Vegas, and I am staying in Vegas. And yes, I have a two-star hotel in Vegas, Super 8. There was a time when I frequented Super 8, the Motel 6, regularly, on the regular. Since I gained the point in my current firm and my financial situation, the tax bracket has changed. I no longer engage in two star two star hotels. In fact I vowed that I would never do it again. And I definitely have gotten accustomed to a three and four star hotel accommodation. I've learned to expect that, but I'm gearing myself up for the two-star treatment. One of the only things that I'm really concerned about is cleanliness. I think I can stand some noise, a little bit of noise. Hoodlums hanging around, feeling like my property is threatened, wondering who's going to knock on my door, that kind of stuff. It's far off in the distance. I'm getting used to it now. As I get on the 215 North, which will take me to the 15, which takes me to Vegas. I got maps on for whatever reason. You know what the thing I was thinking about the maps? The reason you have maps on is because, not because you may or may not know the way. And I was thinking about all those people who, uh, back home, the old Negro, who were trying to tell you the better way to go. I tell them, you just turn here, turn there, turn by that. And when you get to the 7-Eleven, not the first one, but the second 7-Eleven, those kind of directions, people. And I'm not saying they're right or wrong. And they do know some tricks, definitely. But what they don't know is current traffic conditions. And that's one thing that Google can give you. 
Google can also tell you your estimated time of arrival, which I have found is very, very accurate. Though so it may change as the drug, oh, I forgot to brush my teeth and I forgot to bring teeth brush. So my mouth feels that kind of way. It wouldn't be so bad if my mouth didn't feel that kind of way. I ate breakfast. LA County Fair. I ate breakfast, like a normal work day, moderate breakfast. Uh, Italian sausage. I had actually two halves, two kind of halves. A little bit of extra grit, and probably a little bit extra sour grit. I mean, uh, cottage cheese, just because I know I would be, you know, on the ride. Put that some of my stomach. But got to take my vitamins. I got them right here. I just took my multivitamin that I got from Costco, Kirkland. Or did I get these? No, I might have ordered these online. I might have ordered this Kirkland online. I think get like 500 for like 15, 15 bucks or something. Also, I uh, am using my camera holder, phone holder. But it's a really good one that I got years ago. And for some reason, it wasn't sticking. It kept falling off, falling off, falling off. And then I remember they said to wash, wipe it off with warm water. So I... Okay, note to self, so you're not going to record my voice? You're not recording me at all? Note to self, can you hear me? Am I being recorded? I don't think you hear me. Ah, ah! Okay, so you hear me now? I had to scream. Is it working? Note to self, when you are recording, don't be connected to Bluetooth. Especially Android Auto. Just don't do it. When you're recording on the phone, just don't do it. I don't know how much of this you can see or not see, but coming up through the pass, it was fun to come out from under the rainy, drizzly gray and then come through the clouds and have the beautiful sun come up. Sunshine it lit up everything and it made the ride a lot better and everybody was happy and waving at each other and we all pulled over to the side and had one big giant traffic hug and then rainbows shot out our asses and bunnies start running around our toes why am I so cynical is cynical the word or am I just being an asshole it's cynical the word. Anyhow, 15 North, Coon Pass. I believe I'm reaching the summit, and I do believe that sign right there is does say Cahoon Summit elevation, and it's, it's being blocked, of course. It's perfectly blocked by the truck. But we hit the summit, now we're going down the other side of the summit to go famous Cahoon Pass. Oh, I got the Bluetooth turned off, so my remote stop and start won't work. I got the phone. I got the. I got the. Uh, I got the radio all the way off. I'm not going to talk about testing. I'm gonna have to take some time and invest some energy in setting up this camera <coughs> to videotape myself or to film me in the proper perspective or light that I feel worthy of Jeffrey TV. One thing about driving to then I said I was going to not talk about testing 
One thing about driving to Vegas is a lot of young kids, there's a lot of Vegas energy. So people are kind of driving aggressively and, you know, they're hyped up. They're going to Vegas. And you can see, you know, they're probably drinking, you know, probably at a, I mean, let's just, let's just be honest. You know, kids, everybody together, rah, 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 oh, I can't wait. You know, Vegas, baby, blah, 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 blah. So there's a lot of, I wouldn't even call it aggressive driving. It's not just aggressive, but it's just ridiculous. People like trying to weave in and out and there's no place to go. There's like no place to go. Where are you weaving in and out to? I don't understand. I just get out of their way and let them go and do what they're going to do. I just let them, I just get out of their way. I mean, go ahead. Go right ahead. Go ahead. Bye, Mr. Man. No reason for you to be riding that close to the back of my car anyway. Seems like you need some brake light back there, buddy. You need some brake light back there, don't you? That's why I come you running up on my car like that? Because you want some brake light? Here goes some. And I don't hit it hard. I just tap it. All you need is to whoop. And that, that'll jerk them up enough and they'll slow down. Sometimes they'll slow down and you'll get them good enough to where they'll react. And they'll get angry and try to run up on you closer. Then I just kindly turn, put on my blinking signal. Like I'm going to the right lane, like I'm gonna pull over, move over out of the next lane. Do that for about 13 minutes. And they'll sit back behind you. <laughs> it could be a completely open lane. And whether you got your signal on or not, they'll sit right behind you waiting for you to move. And I'll be like, dog, figure it out. And sometimes you won't even be in the left lane. Well, if I'm in the left lane, I don't stay in the left lane, number one. I don't stay in the left lane unless I'm going as fast as I possibly can in traffic. I will move out of the way. Go on by me. Because that's the way I was brought up. I said I was brought up in Ohio and they take the left lane serious. The left lane is for passing and for you know, passing and speeding and whatever. And if you're not in there, if you're in there and you just kind of coasting, you're wrong. So now I'm looking over here at this guy running up all in this truck. Y'all ain't going nowhere. Y'all ain't going nowhere. Might as well chill. But I get the energy. I get the energy. I understand. I was young once. And rah, 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 I was there. Oh, y'all missing this view. I got to figure this out. I might pull over just so I can set this camera up so that you can see what I'm seeing. I got to figure something out. Granted, and it's a different look, too. It's not like the look I see when I go back to Ohio, driving from Cleveland to Youngstown with the trees. I don't know. Are those forests? Can it, we are, I, was thought, I don't think of them as forests. I guess they might be forests. I just see it. But, you know, the trees along the highway and... You know, trees just everywhere back there. This is the desert. There are no trees. <laughs> this is the desert. There's like no trees. It's like shrubbery, if you can call it that. That's not too bad of a look, is it? I think I figured it out. I think I actually figured it out. And it's kind of embarrassing. It took me five years to do it. Instead of mounting it on the windshield, I'm mounting it on the dash. And that's not too horrible. I wish I can get a higher, I said I wasn't gonna talk about testing anymore. I really am trying to do my best to not talk about that. You know, T-E-S-T-I-N-G. So, we'll see how that goes. Nope, not gonna talk about it. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. I think that's a little better, huh? Let's see how long it'll stand up like that before it falls. Maybe I can just keep. I'm not talking about it. I'm not talking about it. Let's just talk about something else. Funk night. Yay. Funk night. Funk night. Funk night. Vegas, baby. Funk night. Vegas, baby. Funk night. I just enjoy being by myself. I do. 
I really do. And with the technology out now and the access to what to platforms such as Facebook and internet and audiences, it's to the point now that I don't even, I don't um, write text anymore on Facebook. Facebook is my main outlet. Facebook is my main outlet. I'm gonna put it, I'm almost at Barstow? Oh my. Oh my. Linwood, I'm almost at Barstow. Now I gotta remember which this is to take to go to Barstow. My God, I'm up here playing doing stuff with my cameras and filming and blah, 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 and blah, and blah. I'm coming up to where I need to be. World famous outlets at Barstow. That's Barstow. Now, where's Barstow Station? Is it this one? Is it this exit? I don't see it. I don't see the big barrel thing. It better not be it. Is this it? McDonald's, Denny's, uh, Linwood Road. I keep forgetting which one it is. Is this it? Barstow Road, three and a half miles. I don't think this is it. I don't think this is it. I'm telling you, you seem like I do this so much you think I have it figured out by now. No, this ain't the one. So I'm gonna keep going. I knew it wasn't the one, because I even said it, didn't I say it? But I do remember that gas station over there. Yeah, there's a flying J's and Canes. This ain't the one we want. This ain't the one we want. This ain't the one we want, people. I mean, I've done this enough time. I knew it wasn't this first one. I knew it wasn't this first one. I don't know why I got off on here. I knew it wasn't this first one. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Kind of windy out here, shaking the car. I don't know if you can see it. It's shaking the car. The Jeep. The Jeep is shaking. Yeah, it's windy up here. Here we go. This is a long light for crying out loud. Just to keep going. I'm going to make a left. Oh, I need to get over in that lane over there. Y'all gonna let me do it? <coughs> y'all gonna go straight. Most of y'all gonna go straight anyway. Cause y'all didn't mean that y'all meant to get off here. Not unlike me. See, I knew that. So I just made to come over here and just jump right back on <laughs> and keep going. Cause I knew this wasn't the one. I always get it mixed up. I always do. You think I would just good? One time we got off the wrong one. I got off the wrong one. We got off, I was with uh, the child my niece and her friends and some kids, basically. They put all the kids in my car. And I got off at the wrong one, and my niece knew which way to go. She was like, um, 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 go that way. And sure enough, she was right. Hanging with her grandmother. Her grandmother gonna teach her everything. And, and, if, and, if, and here's the way you go to the Barstow Station. And here's the way you get, and I can hear my mother teaching her every little step of the way. So that when she grew up, she could be like the driver and take her back and forth to Vegas. I wonder if that ever happened. I wonder if they ever did that. I wonder if the child ever drove my mother to Vegas because the child didn't want to didn't want to drive for a long time. The child didn't want to drive till she was like older. And by that time, my mother was, you know, retired and going through things. All right, L Street. I forget the name of it, but we'll find it. Is it L Street or is it Barstow Road? L Street, Main. we'll see which one. It's either one of these up here. I never knew which one. I never know which one. I never knew. I mean, I knew, but I've been here so many times. You know, you just don't, you know, you just don't do it. And to put it in Barstow Station is cheating. I know it ain't this one. I know it ain't this one. Yeah, you can see it ain't that one. So it must be Barstow Road. Now I guess I know the official name. I need music. I need Jeffrey TV music. Oh boy, what is this? Traffic. Traffic. And uh, here you go. Traffic. And did I miss Barstow Station? Did I miss it? Why are you going to pull up beside me and slow down when you know I need to get over in that lane, Mr. Oregon? 
Did I pass Barstow Station? How can I miss Barstow Station? Maybe I don't need no candy. That's what it is. Maybe it's gone. You never know. You don't you don't know. It could be gone. I need Jeffrey TV music. Okay, I remember now. It's East Main Street. <laughs> it's East Main Street. Not only because I can see it, but I do remember it being East Main Street. And you can see the McDonald's and everything. And I do remember it actually being East Main Street. And I'm not just saying that. What's with the traffic, though? What is with the traffic? That's the part that's getting me. How come nobody getting off on East Main Street but me? I'm the only one. Nobody else getting off. Look at the McDonald's. Look, it looked like they redid it. Looked like they kind of modernized that McDonald's. There we go. Here's the bar stove we all know and love. Just come up here, drive straight through like I do. Probably could have turned in and did it quicker, but I like going around the back for whatever reason. I always come in and go through the back. It was windy. You see wind blowing people? What's she doing with ice cream in the middle of the day? Black folks out here. Greyhound. Look at the dog. I used to ride that dog. I've been here. I used to be these people standing over there at their break. We used to stop at Barstow Station. I used to ride that dog. Not a complaint. I used to be a Greyhound. I used to be a Greyhound rider and I probably still, ooh, I could park right there. I could park right there. That's almost too nice and too convenient. I don't even want that one, actually. I want something a little bit more farther away and difficult. And these people parking tight. Uh, these people parking tight. These people parking tight. Barstow Station! Alright, let's see if this is gonna work. Here we are, Barstow Station, baby. The bathroom, that's the first place I need to go. So I need to cut this off and go to the bathroom. Oh, there's the men's. I always gonna walk into the women's bathroom again. Here we go. I see the candy. The candy's coming.
foul. So nothing. Nope. All right, can we see now? All right, there goes We just came out the bathroom. Blah, blah, blah. Had technical difficulties. I said I wasn't going to start talking about talking. Here we are, Barstow Station. I mean, who could buy a stick? Number 66. You can buy another stick. Kansas City. I didn't get the Steeler duffel bag last time. $30. That's probably why. Here's the candy. Panda Express, McDonald's, the line. Oh. Popcorn. Where'd I see that candy at? Where'd I see that candy? Oh, here's where it was. I remember now. I remember now. Yeah, it comes on to like a certain amount of pounds. Boston baked beans. I don't want none of this stuff. I don't even know why I stopped here. Let's be real. I just come here to see what's up. I don't want none of this. Do I? Do I? I don't. I don't need nothing here. California. I thought that said Ohio. Where if they have your plate up here? Where if they have one of your plates off your old car or something? How does that work? All right, I'm done with this place. We're finished. Yeah, I'm over it. I'm over it. Let's get out of here. I just stopped the piss. I don't even know. I just came here just to get footage. Cause there ain't really nothing. Nothing really going on. Nothing really worth doing anything for or about so get on the road get out of here and do what we got to do where we got to do it might as well get to where we want to get to that's the place where you can sit deep oh that's kind of cool i don't want to be nosy what is this walk between the cars but what is it Look at my vehicle. Can you see it? Vegas, baby. Vegas, baby. Everybody come. There'd be a lot of black folks going to Vegas. What's that about? Look at that beautiful vehicle. Look at that beautiful, beautiful vehicle. I'm going to get it washed. I'm going to get it washed. As you can see, here's how I got the setup now. Here's how I got that setup. Kind of homemade. You can do a mix of two different technologies. I mean, definitely two different technologies. Two different aspects of putting it together. All right. Leaving Barstow Station. Went in there, didn't really do nothing. I post a video of nothing that I did because I didn't do nothing. Didn't really want to buy no candy. I mean, I did, but I didn't want to spend that money. I can get the same stuff. Well, I can't get the same stuff. That is some good candy. That's not, that's not even full of stuff. That is some good candy. It's like it's just going out this way. You can't go out that way, so I'm not going to. I'm going to observe the rules and regulations. How's that look? What? Is that okay? Looks like it might be a little bit crooked. There's the famous trains that are around there. I think this is the way you go out here. Wow, what did he do? He did something fancy. Yeah. So many, you know, 
newcomers and people, you know, with families and they're learning and, you know, they're not, they're timid. They don't know what's going on. They're unsure and I have to be patient. I have to learn to be patient. Because I used to be that too at one time. Many, many moons ago. Many, many moons ago. Now I'm just an old-fashioned love song playing on your radio. Goodbye, Barstow. Not sure why I stopped here. Maybe to do the camera, I'm not sure. Goodbye, Barstow. It was fun. It was fun, Barstow. Barstow. It was fun. Woo, 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 woo. And Mick, ooh. And yeah, I gotta watch what I'm doing here, people. Watch what you're doing, Mr. Mitchell. Watch what you're doing. You don't wanna cause an accident or worse yet, get hurt. And Miss Funk Knight. You don't want to miss Funk Night. Funk Night with Garrett Scheider of Parliament Funkadelic and Noah Wood Fisher, formerly of Fishbone. <laughs> Is it too soon? Had to get the air conditioner on. You can believe it. 75 degrees out there. Oh, yeah. Okay. This is a little bit warm out there. Plus, we're not used to this warm. I'm not used to this warm. So I put the air on just to get some air in the place, you know. It looks foggy. It looks smoggy out there, doesn't it? Is it me or does it look smoggy? Or like hazy? Or whatever that word is. It means that. I hope that's straight, because you know I can't stand if it ain't straight. Well, if it ain't straight, I'll straighten it out. And I kind of probably don't like that camera rocking so much. Oops, I said I wasn't going to talk about that. I probably could listen to the station I listen to on Sirius XM Chill and not get flagged by Facebook for playing the music. I could probably actually <laughs> play this on the uh, background of what I'm doing and Facebook probably might not recognize it. It may be so obscure, I'm thinking. Or they may not care. Maybe, you know, the, the mixers or the DJs, maybe it won't register. We'll find out. Uh, they might say, hey, copyright, blah, 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 blah. And I'll say, oh, you're right, you got me, you got me. What I listen to going to funk night. But I can see the uh, audio is on red, so it looks like you can. Funk night. So, one thing I didn't fully consider: traffic. Traffic going to Vegas on a Friday morning. Had I considered it, I would have thought Friday morning people still at work. It should be light. Should be get through, get by. I was wrong. Crashes, as in plural, on I-15 North. I drove probably for about 45 minutes, and a GPS said two hours and 40 minutes that whole time, two hours and 40 minutes until arrival for like an hour, and it was stuck on that. So it directed me off of the uh, freeway, and I took SEMA Road, supposed to take this 13 miles to Kingston, it's supposed to save 37 minutes. 
I'm not the only one who's doing this. There's a bunch of us on this road, but we're moving. You can see this ain't our normal 15 freeway. And you, I think you can pretty much see the traffic that's going on up there. Now I'm on this alternate route, and I got my second phone turning. This is where Google Center. This is where Google sent us. This is even a paved road. This doesn't even look like a road. And it's got to be at least 100 cars coming down this thing. This is where, how long do we got to go? 33 miles. To, oh, my God. We got 33 miles on this? This is even a real road. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> can you not love it? Can you not love it? Oh, look at this. Uh, can you see this? Can you see this? It's a good thing I got, oh, are people slowing down? No, 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 don't get us all trapped out here. Oh, uh, what is this? Who's like, what if Google made a mistake? What if Google made a mistake? 33 miles on this? You've got to be kidding me. Oh, my God. Oh, my, what is this? Let me see, is this real? Are you serious? This is going to save 33 minutes? <laughs> Look where we at. Can you see this? Ooh. -hoo. And this car is behind me. There's a lot of us out here. You, hear, you can probably hear the bumping and the, 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 the vibrations and all that, too. Ooh, Google. I'm doing 40 miles an hour, and we're supposed to go on here for 32 more miles? When is this thing going to get paid? It looks like one way, too. Oh, uh, <laughs> whose idea was this? Funk Night, Funk Night, Derek Sider, No Wood Fisher, Funk Night. You got me out here in the middle of nowhere. Good thing it's daytime. Oh my God. Are you serious? Are you kidding me? 